Hello folks, how are you doing today? I am Dr. Jack Williamson and through this platform, we will discuss the most essential thing in your life, your health. Parasite infection and the medicine used to treat it are the topics for today's discussion. Albendazole, its use, how to use it, its side effects and precautions. We will know everything. So if you are using or about to start, this video is going to be very informative. Let's not wait anymore and start. What is an albendazole tablet? Albendazole is a molecule or active ingredient and it is called an anti-parasite medicine. It is the US FDA approved medicine for different types of parasites and was approved in the year 1996. There are many pharmaceutical companies across the globe that manufactures albendazole. It is a tablet form medicine that comes in a strip packaging with 10 tablets in each strip. It also comes in suspension as it is used in children 2 years and older. What is the use of albendazole? Albendazole is used to treat parasite infections in the human body. There are many types of parasites that infect various parts of the body and could become life-threatening if not treated at the right time. There are three major types of parasites, protozoa, helminths and ectoparasites. Their shapes are different, round worms, flat worms, thread worms, etc. These parasites can multiply fast and affect the body part severely to an extent where only surgery remains the last option for recovery. So when a person addresses this condition on time, the health provider suggests this type of medicines. How to use albendazole and how does it work? What albendazole does is interact with the parasite worms and paralyze them. This way, the activity of parasites such as multiplying or destroying human cells stops. After that, the medicine kills them and the body part starts recovering and from infected condition. To achieve this result, a person needs to follow the prescription and take the medicine accordingly. Generally, the health provider first will assess the stage of the infection through a physical checkup and if needed, will make the person do some tests. After gathering all the required information, the health provider will suggest the medicine. But remember, they can differ from person to person as each one has a different infection and other health conditions. Considering that, you will be asked to gulp the pill with water without breaking it in any way. It could be a single dose or multiple in a day that should be taken with food at a fixed time. Do not stop taking the medicine after you feel better as it is a course of medication that needs to be completed. What are the side effects? The side effects are indigestion, abdominal pain, loss of appetite, constipation, vomiting, nausea, headache, fever, fainting, dizziness, diarrhea, taste change, itching, confusion, vision blur, dark urine, hair loss, seizures, hives, acute liver or kidney failure, bone marrow suspension, hepatitis, etc. These are some of the side effects that this medicine could bring. So consulting your health provider before starting the medication is essential. Are there any precautions? Yes, precautions are attached to albendazole medicine. Do not change the dosage or start or stop the medicine without talking with your health provider. Your health provider and pharmacist must know if you are allergic to albendazole, manbendazole, any other medication or any of the inactive ingredient of albendazole. But how do we know that? Simply demand for the same from your health provider. Before your health provider sets the dose, you need to inform which prescription and non-prescription medicines, vitamin, nutrition, supplement and herbal products 
you are taking or planning to take with albendazole. The health provider may need to change the dosage and monitor you for possible side effects. If you have had or are about to have any surgery, your health provider must know in the very first appointment. If you are pregnant or planning to take birth control pills, inform your health provider. In the case you become pregnant while taking albendazole, stop taking the medicine and rush to your health provider and discuss. If your advice, then only start it again. Breastfeeding mothers must inform their health provider. If you are encountering any side effects, inform your health provider. Now you know everything about the albendazole tablet. The information we shared could be helpful for you. Support is does. Please let us know by commenting. If you have forgotten to mention anything, please let us know that too. Friends, the information shared here is for knowledge and it is not authorized medical advice. And remember, we are not promoting any medicine or treatment here. We are just sharing some information. So you must consult your doctor before using any medicine or starting any treatment. So that is it for now. I will see you in some other video and on other topic. Until then, if you have liked this video, appreciate our efforts by subscribing to this channel. Hit the like button and comment. Let us know what you feel about the video. You can also suggest what topic we should make a video on. Do not forget to share it with your family and friends and let them know about the Albendazole tablet. Be alert, be healthy.